I think it, you know, if you look around, all these people get to see it. Everyone walking through. Last year, we, we got in the situation where kids didn't even know we had a, a varsity program. So I think that's a big thing, just to give us some promotion. We got about eight or nine recruits that we invited that are here. We've got some parents that are here. So it just gets more exposure as far as our program. The guys will work a little bit harder today just because they're out in, out in front of people. And anything you can do something different with, with, with young men, I think they respond differently. And, you know, one of the kids is, well, I don't like wrestling in front, practice in front of people. And I'm like, well, you got to wrestle in front of people. So it's just, it's about giving, putting kids in different situations and seeing how they react. And, uh, you know, the better and the smarter kids you get, the less you have to worry about them doing things that make us want to do more during the preseason. And uh, to simplify that, we got a bunch of good kids and, and we trust them and we know they aren't beating up their bodies. So there's only so much we needed to do in the, in the preseason compared to other years when we we're really trying to keep our keep our thumbs on them. These guys I don't really need to. They're, they're a good good group of guys. We've got about seven or eight guys that are gonna help us very, very shortly with our, our, our you know with, with our team. Um, and what I mean that I don't know about this year, but definitely next year and in the future. Um, I think we've got maybe one or two that might be able to start for us this year. And if they're the best guy we're gonna use them. I think the rest of them they're either behind really good guys or they're just in that stage where they're athletic, they work real hard, they're good, but maybe they just aren't ready to start this year. And, I'm one of those guys that believes that this, you know, between high school and college is a huge difference. Unless you're a blue chip kid, we, we like to just take our time with developing them and, and really work them into starting. Ian will be going to the All-Star Classic and about 20 of our other guys will be going to uh, the Clarion Open. It's not on our schedule, so they're going on their own, they're paying for it on their own. Um, we're not allowed to coach them, but they're going to go there to get some, some quality matches in. Good chance for us to give us an idea where those young guys are at and what they're going to need. If you really look at it, there's about seven or eight good weekends for, for open tournaments for, for guys that aren't starting, and that, that week's one of them with the Clarion Open. So we're going we're gonna to encourage a lot of kids to go and attend that Clarion Open, which isn't far. They go in and out the same day, and it's a great opportunity for our guys to get some quality matches. We're about a week into it, um, and I'm pretty happy with where we're at. Like I said, we got a lot of really, really good kids. And like I said, when you have good kids, you don't have to worry about some of the things that I've worried about in the past with our guys. So. Um, like I said, I'm real excited about the year. We got a lot of returning starters and uh, a lot of young guys that I think will be able to help us and, and get us to reach some of our goals.